Hi everybody, Paranormal Paul. Tonight has been a very, very strange evening. There's been a strange mist all over the Sussex, like Brighton Hove, and it's very been it's been very quiet. But on the other occasion, I've heard not whispers, but actual voices. It sounds like they're saying. Um, hi or help um, my, my dreams lately have been very strange I've been um, it's like I'm looking straight ahead and I can see buildings and in the middle there's like a it's just the figure of a man or a woman but it's jet black I cannot make out any facial features nothing I don't know if it's a man or a woman but that's the last day or two I've been getting that um, the reason I'm here is this is my neighbor and a few weeks back he passed actually inside uh, I'm here to test the theory as to whether he's crossed or whether he's still here here walking so <clears throat> like I said today has been very strange um, I have set up a couple of EMF readers the blue one was going uh, it's down by the front door there it was flashing for a little bit and then stopped now I want to get this across guys you have neighbors but do you actually know them do you know them by name do you communicate because there's since the last few years has been a serious separation a divide and we all know who's done it it's the the governing powers you know, they basically separated everyone, even friends and family. It's disgusting, it really is. Because now, I see it when I'm driving my bus, everyone looks so miserable. Um, everyone's got attitude. You know, there's no communication. And it's very sad. You know, since the dawn of time, it's always been brother versus brother, sister versus sister. And I wanted to call out tonight for all those that are in regret, you know, all those that fought wars against one another and gained very little at the end and now they live in shame in sin you know I am what you would consider a peaceful guy I help whomever I can and 9 out of 10 once my uses are used up, I get dropped and forgotten. And it's happening as we speak right now, but I won't mention names. And it's happened to me so many times, and I'm just used to it now. I do believe that it is a, a calling of mine, that I'm sent certain individuals to help, and when I'm no longer needed, they move on. Or perhaps even I'm moved on. I'm not sure which way it goes.
the names Enlil and Enki keep coming up in here for some reason. Now I looked them up and they were part of the Anunnaki, believe it or not. Um, I don't know who the father was, but apparently they were both given parts of the world and they did nothing but war amongst themselves. And in the middle of it was human beings. We were slaves. But before humans, there was another race, which were also slaves. When we were, when we came along, I wouldn't say created, but when we came along, we were enslaved. And then we killed off the previous slave race. And then we overthrew the Anunnaki. So we now populate the earth. This is what I've managed to figure out by reading up on hist history made up by human beings. Truth or not, I don't know, but there is there is a God in there somewhere. Now, I don't presume to know his name. Um, begins with a Y. I believe Joshua has mentioned it. Um, there was Jesus Christ, the Son. His name was uh, Yeshua. And there was brothers and sisters, but what are their names? Very strange. Now this has all come about simply because um, one of my videos to do with a factory recently a certain party or individual put a comment on my video saying I think it was Jesus Saves I think that was the channel name and they were basically saying that I am communicating with demons and they are deceiving me and they're going to overwhelm me and corrupt me now I replied with, I am protected, I know I am, I've heard it for myself, they've told me, I've heard from my actual mum that died back in 1988. So I do believe in my heart, my brain, my soul, that I am serving the light. And I know you have subscribed to this channel because you trust and believe in what I do. You trust and believe that there is a Lord God, a heaven, a unity. And that religion somewhere along the line has corrupted so many people. It's divided us all. It's separated us all and it's created wars, famine brother against brother. Now, whether that was deliberately done or not, I don't know. But religion is like factions. We're all spread all over the world and we all think we own our own unique part of it. And it's not the case. If you buy a house, if you buy it on a plot of land, you're paying another human being for that land, for that house. And it's not his to sell in the first place. It belongs to our creator. Fair enough, you have it for the time you buy it until you die, or until you sell, or until you pass it on to the next one. And yes, it remains yours, but it's not yours. It's just borrowed. The, f the very f fabric of the building is from the earth. 
everything on the earth is lent to us. We don't own nothing. And the governments are trying to prove that now, aren't they? But they're doing it so they own everything and we own nothing. They're keeping us as slaves. Does it sound familiar? Now, I know a lot of people think I'm stupid because I can't get my words out sometimes. I go all uh, jelly eeled at the feet, <laughs> you know, uh, jellied in the brain. I can't get what I want to say out. So this mist tonight has somehow brought me out of my shell now. Or is it the dreams that I've had in the last couple of days? That figure, it's not coming towards me, it's not saying anything, it's just stood there. And I can't even say if it's staring at me because I can't see any eyes. But I've been waking up with some serious headaches and it feels like I've not been asleep. And then today, I kept hearing, it sounded like a little girl's voice, I've heard a man's voice, and, yeah. Did you hear that? Right, now I'm going to fire up the um, ghost tube, so I don't want to be filming for too long. It's actually a mild temperature. It should be freezing, but it's not. So I'm actually filming in proper camera. I'm going to run the ghost tube separately. <laughs> Tree. Tree. I've got one in my garden. Souls, hear me. If you reside here, please communicate with me. The man that lived at this address and died recently. Are you here? It's Paul, your neighbour. Have you crossed over? Or do you still reside in this house? Use this device to speak. Can you hear me? Can you hear me in there? I'm going to give you three knocks. Can you respond? Where is it? Where is what?
you know me, my name is Paul. I live just next door. Can you speak to me? Do you need help? Your son moved out because he couldn't cope with living here. There's too many memories. Don't be scared, come forward. Heaven. Are you in heaven? It's excellent if you made it. He was a good man, from what I knew. You had children, grandchildren. Ralph. Hi, Ralph. Guys, honestly, you want to see down the pathway, like a, there's a mist just rolling up the hill. Who's Ralph? Was he another tenant that lived round here? I'm going to take that uh, response as heaven. Is that he's crossed over? Because there's, there's nothing on the EMFs. Before I continue this guys, I'm going to say a prayer. <clears throat> My Lord, I call upon you today and I ask that you help any and all souls that may be lost or stuck or being held against their will, including any souls that may be within this home. If you could help these souls to find their way to unity in heaven, to be at peace, with their loved ones, their families. What should I do? Please help these souls to find their way to unity and finally be at peace, be at rest. Amen. Souls, if you can hear me, you must ascend. You must leave this place. Go to the light. I'm going to do is cut this off and I'm going to use a bit of necrophonic. I just, no. That EMF just flashed. Souls. I call upon my mum. Susan Ann, can you hear me? I seek communication with you. I need to know that you are okay. You've spoken through this device many times. I need to know that I'm doing right. Please speak to me. Oh. 
Jawohl. Mom, can you hear me? I need to know that you're okay. Souls in unity, can you hear me? I would like to think that I am blessed by the light of God. I hope and pray every day. And when I help the souls, it's from my heart, it's from my soul. Please, please tell me that my mum is safe. I love you, mum. don't answer a lot, but I serve you in all things. What I do is for the light, for the peace, for the love, and for unity. I ask for your guidance. I ask for your help to fight the darkness, to free these souls. Bless each and every one of you. And everyone I've ever known. Okay, goodbye. Talk. I will talk to you soon. Right. I'm going to listen to that really hard with headphones. Yeah, guys, I know 
my videos seem a bit boring at times but um, Teresa can't, can't walk far because of her legs which I'm I'm understandable about I don't mind standing in front of a car and investigating because 9 out of 10 we always pick stuff up anyway um, Josh is working a lot so he doesn't get a chance to come out um, we're all penalised in one sense or another I work a lot as well I work nights and sometimes seven nights on the truck and Dave I can only see him once in a blue moon because he lives in Dorset so um, and you know I do try and do videos on my own but it can be very scary not because the spirit world because I don't fear anything like that because I'm protected so it's the living they're, they're the ones to fear and you know when you go to a place and it's pitch black and you don't know what you're walking into you don't know if you're going to walk back out again you know that's a terrifying thing but at the same time if it's your time it's your time it doesn't matter how it happens or when it just does I think we start I've started off all the animals around here for some reason <laughs> so I will say I am very grateful gracious that you watch the channel and are sticking by me Teresa, Josh, Dave and anybody else that comes out with me um, which I'm hoping in the future will be a lot more people so um, I do believe that YouTube itself is too Americanized so they seem to stunt the English not so much the English England so you know we really have to struggle to get anywhere um, I say that because the content that I bring you is no different to what they bring and yet they get 50,000 views I get 50 so doesn't that tell you something anyway I will say if anybody resides within this home be set free leave this place and go to unity in heaven be at peace God bless you I don't think he's flashed at all so I do believe he has crossed over but I did that just in case and any other souls from the past you never know so I live just there and it seems weird he passed away a couple of weeks ago and I've been having these it's like uh, vivid dreams and I'm waking up with headaches and whether that's a sign for anything else I don't know it just seems like something's coming something is definitely coming so anyway I'm going to sign off from here guys go home and go to bed because uh, I finished work and it's coming on nine and a half past three so I shall see you all soon very next video and as always God bless you all guys be safe and be nice to each other that's all we got left